Measles is a viral illness. It's airborne and it's highly contagious. So that means that if 10 people are exposed and they all are susceptible or they don't have immunity to measles, nine out of 10 will get infected um, with measles. Uh, measles can be a really severe illness. Um, and so it can result in hospitalization and really rare complications with very severe complications like pneumonia, um, inflammation of the brain tissue, even death. And so it's really, really important to know whether you have immunity to measles and to get vaccinated if you don't have immunity. The vaccine is very safe. There are countless studies looking at the MMR vaccine in babies and in adults, and the consensus is that it is very safe. And it's really important to check to make sure that you've been vaccinated and that your children or your family members have been vaccinated. So what you can do if you're pregnant and you're not sure about your vaccine status is you can double check your vaccine status. The other thing you can do is have your prenatal uh, care provider check your immune status, checking your titers against measles to see whether or not you have immunity. In pregnancy, pregnant people are at high risk for severe illness with measles infection. That includes developing pneumonia or being hospitalized with a measles illness. But the fetus is also at risk. So pregnant women who have measles are at high risk for miscarriage, stillbirth, a small baby, which means that the baby doesn't grow well in the uterus. And then the other thing is preterm delivery. If you are thinking about getting pregnant anytime soon, it's really important to check your immune status, uh, see if you've been vaccinated, get those vaccines prior to getting pregnant. So that would include the MMR vaccine. If you are pregnant and you're worried about exposure, you're worried about potential exposure in the future, you can always contact your health care provider, your prenatal health provider, and check your immunity. If you feel like you have potentially been exposed, you should immediately contact your health care provider.